Yeah. <laughs> when cannabis pioneer Be Real helped found the iconic L.A.-based rap group Cypress Hill, there were no vape pens or fancy dispensaries. That was definitely taboo in, in the beginning, you know, when we put out our first record in 91. There's a lot of people, you know, that were going to jail with mere possession. Obviously, as, as stoners, we didn't think that was right and we didn't want that happening to us. And there was a, a lot of propaganda against the cannabis culture at that point. So, you know, we, we sort of helped to tear that down. What do you think about how far things have come? It's extraordinary, to be quite honest. So you got your three cameras set up for your live shoots? Yeah. Eight years ago, he founded Be Real TV. You're one of the reefer kings, man. You're an one online network masters. devoted to music to and yes. cannabis. Fortunately, this caught for us, you know. In, in the beginning, you know, we had to make calls and say, hey, you know, can so-and-so come down and do an interview with us? Now people want to be booked on your show. Now people want to be booked on the show. And now people call us. What you gonna do? What you gonna do? 